An extraordinary event is unfolding right now, capturing the attention of astronomers worldwide. Betelgeuse, the captivating red supergiant star that marks the shoulder of the constellation Orion, is undergoing a remarkable transformation. Its brilliance, the intense glow that defines its celestial presence, has surged by an astonishing 50%. At the start of this year, Betelgeuse was the tenth brightest star in our night sky, but this unexpected flare has pushed it up to the seventh. Betelgeuse is a massive star in the later stages of its life, so enormous that if it were placed at the center of our solar system, it would stretch all the way to Jupiter's orbit. Eventually, this star will collapse, resulting in a dramatic supernova explosion that could lead to the formation of either a neutron star or a black hole. The excitement surrounding Betelgeuse's impending supernova is immense because, at roughly 650 light-years away, humanity is in a prime position to witness this incredible event firsthand. When the explosion occurs, it will produce a spectacular light show. A burst of neutrinos will race across Earth, detectable by observatories worldwide. Then, as high-energy photons escape from the expanding cloud of cosmic debris, Betelgeuse will rapidly brighten, potentially reaching up to 100,000 times its normal luminosity over the course of a week. Depending on the power of the explosion, this celestial event could rival the brightness of a full moon and may even be visible during daylight, casting visible shadows at night. This extraordinary occurrence will persist for a prolonged period offering astronomers a unique opportunity for detailed observations and groundbreaking discoveries. Though the thought of Betelgeuse's supernova might stir both excitement and apprehension due to its association with ominous predictions, there is no need for concern, as we are safely distant from any harmful effects. To fully understand the mystery of Betelgeuse, we must look back to the end of 2019, when certain peculiarities began to emerge. During this time, the star's brightness began to noticeably diminish, an event visible even to the naked eye. Observations with advanced telescopes revealed that Betelgeuse appeared largely stable, but its outer layers showed signs of severe disturbance. The star's photosphere, the outermost layer where light is emitted, had expanded, causing Betelgeuse to appear larger from our vantage point on Earth. This expansion occurred at a steady rate of about 8 km per second for much of the year, until mid-November 2019, when the outward motion slowed down. By then, the mass ejection had stopped, prompting astronomers to capture new optical images of the star. These images revealed two major anomalies, a darkened region in the southern hemisphere of the star and a drop in its surface temperature by approximately 80 Kelvin between January 27 and February 13, 2020. About a year after the mass ejection ceased, Betelgeuse regained its brightness, eventually returning to its normal state. This led scientists to wonder what had actually happened to Betelgeuse. The available evidence pointed to an extraordinary event known as a surface mass ejection, SME, a phenomenon akin to the coronal mass ejections, CMEs, observed on the sun imagine a volcanic eruption on a star scale, where material from within the star erupts outward, causing shock waves throughout its atmosphere. Over time, this material forms particles and dust, partially obscuring our view and making the star appear dimmer. In Betelgeuse's case, this resulted in the ejection of mass 400 billion times greater than what is typically seen in such events on other stars, equivalent to many times the mass of the moon, propelled at tremendous speeds. This unprecedented mass ejection allowed astronomers to observe surface features in real time, using the Hubble Space Telescope, offering a rare glimpse into the aging and evolution of a dying star. The SME likely caused Betelgeuse to lose a significant amount of mass in a single event, possibly expelling its outer layers and entering a recovery phase. Following this event, Betelgeuse's behavior changed. Previously known for pulsating in a regular cycle of approximately 400 days, it began pulsating at shorter intervals, every 200 days. Betelgeuse is classified as a semi-regular variable star, meaning its brightness fluctuates due to changes in its size and temperature. These changes are driven by two main pulsation periods, one lasting around 400 days, thought to be caused by pulsations in the star's core, and a longer cycle of about 5.6 years, whose origin remains unclear. Through computer simulations, astronomers gained a deeper understanding of the events that transpired. They suggested that a particularly hot gas bubble, 
similar to the behavior of a pot of boiling soup, had formed inside the star. These bubbles sometimes emerge from the star's convective envelope, and when one of these bubbles rose and broke through the star's surface, it triggered the release of material and disrupted Betelgeuse's normal pulsation cycle. As the star's surface expanded and its deeper layers contracted, the star transitioned from its usual 400-day pulsation cycle to a new 200-day one. Astronomers believe that over the next 5 to 10 years, Betelgeuse will likely stabilize its pulsation cycles, eventually returning to its normal 400-day rhythm. As for the possibility of Betelgeuse undergoing a supernova, scientists predict it could happen any time within the next 10,000 to 100,000 years, based on the star size, brightness, and age. Betelgeuse is likely in the early stages of helium fusion, which will continue with the fusion of carbon, oxygen, silicon, and ultimately iron, before the star's core collapses under its own gravity, resulting in a cataclysmic explosion. Given that Betelgeuse is located 650 light-years away, any supernova event would not be visible to us until 650 years after it occurs, due to the speed of light. Therefore, it is unlikely that we will witness the star's dramatic end in our lifetime. One fascinating aspect of Betelgeuse is that we can actually observe its surface, a rarity among stars. This provides an incredible opportunity to study the behavior of massive stars as they age, including observing events like mass ejections. Recently, astronomers made a chilling discovery when they observed a star 12,000 light-years away consuming its own planet, an event that underscores the dramatic and unpredictable nature of stellar evolution. Betelgeuse, with its striking name and prominent. Betelgeuse, associated with the Hindu lunar house Ardra and the tempest god Rudra, has intrigued humanity since ancient times. Known for its crucial role in cultural practices, the star has appeared in traditions across the globe. For example, in Macedonian customs, it symbolized the importance of trained animals and agrarian life, while in regions like North Baffin Island and Melville Peninsula, its rise signified the onset of spring and longer days. Betelgeuse's cultural significance is tied to its position in the constellation Orion, where it marks the right shoulder of the hunter and stands as one of the brightest stars in the sky. As the eleventh most luminous star, it continues to captivate and inspire artists, scholars and creators alike. There's much more to uncover about Betelgeuse's ongoing transformation and its potential to explode as a supernova. Its gradual evolution offers a fascinating glimpse into the life cycle of massive stars. Observations of its current behavior have revealed a number of unusual phenomena that extend beyond changes in luminosity. In-death studies of Betelgeuse's atmosphere have shown complex interactions between its outer layers and the solar wind. These unique features have made it the subject of intense scientific investigation, not only due to its eventual supernova but also to its present state and historical behavior. In recent years, astronomers have employed advanced techniques to study Betelgeuse's outer layers. Spectroscopic observations have revealed a rich mixture of elements, including helium, hydrogen, carbon, and oxygen, which provide vital clues about its nuclear fusion processes. These elements also help explain how massive stars like Betelgeuse contribute to the chemical enrichment of galaxies by distributing heavy elements into the interstellar medium. Another important aspect of Betelgeuse's study is its magnetic field. While most stars have weak magnetic fields, Betelgeuse exhibits strong magnetic activity. These fields appear to influence the star's solar wind and surface behavior, and this magnetic impact could be linked to the dramatic changes in its luminosity and pulsations observed recently. Understanding these magnetic fields has given scientists new insights into how they might affect the star's evolution and its eventual explosion. In addition to its magnetic field, Betelgeuse's slow rotation is noteworthy. Unlike many other supergiants, Betelgeuse rotates at a relatively leisurely pace. This slow spin is thought to be a remnant of its earlier development, potentially contributing to its current stability and the observed peculiarities in its behavior. The star's rotation, combined with its immense size and mass, plays a crucial role in shaping its outer layers and affecting the way it releases mass. Betelgeuse's development is also closely linked to the dynamics of its environment. Observations suggest that it interacts with a complex system of neighboring stars and interstellar material. 
The gravitational influences of nearby stars could be affecting Betelgeuse's mass loss, which might contribute to its eventual supernova. By studying these interactions, scientists are gaining a better understanding of the broader cosmic context in which Betelgeuse exists. Astrobiology intersects with the study of Betelgeuse in intriguing ways. The star's position in the sky and its dramatic changes capture the imagination of both scientists and the public. The potential for a future supernova raises questions about the impact such an event could have on any nearby planetary systems. Although Betelgeuse itself is not known to host any planets, its eventual explosion could affect nearby systems, potentially influencing their habitability or the formation of new planetary systems. The light emitted by Betelgeuse provides valuable data for testing theoretical models of stellar evolution. By comparing observed data with predictions from these models, scientists can refine their understanding of how massive stars like Betelgeuse evolve over time. One key area of interest is the impact of Betelgeuse's mass loss on its future development. As the star sheds material, its internal structure changes, influencing the dynamics of its core. This mass loss can affect the timing and nature of its eventual supernova. Models that incorporate mass loss rates and their effects on the star's internal processes are essential for predicting when and how Betelgeuse will explode. Public engagement with Betelgeuse has also played an important role in its study. The star's striking appearance and dramatic changes have made it a popular subject for science outreach and education. By sharing the science behind Betelgeuse with a broader audience, astronomers can foster a greater appreciation for the complexities of stellar physics and the dynamic nature of the universe. The study of Betelgeuse is closely tied to the field of cosmic archaeology, as its evolution and eventual explosion will contribute to our understanding of stellar life cycles and the creation of heavy elements. These insights are essential for reconstructing the history of our galaxy and the larger universe. By studying the remnants of Betelgeuse's supernova, researchers can learn more about the processes that shape the cosmos. Additionally, the observational techniques used to study the star are constantly advancing. New innovations in telescope technology and data analysis methods have enabled astronomers to gather more detailed information about Betelgeuse and its behavior. Instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, as well as future space missions, are likely to provide even deeper insights into Betelgeuse and other similar stars, enhancing our understanding of their life cycles and cosmic significance. Betelgeuse's unique position in the Orion constellation also makes it a key reference point for other cosmic studies. Its brightness and proximity to Earth provide an important benchmark for calibrating observations of other distant stars and celestial objects. This role as a reference point helps ensure the accuracy of data gathered across various astronomical surveys and research projects. The scientific community continues to develop new theories and models to explain Betelgeuse's behavior, and each new discovery adds to our broader understanding of massive stars and their evolution. By integrating observational data with theoretical models, astronomers are working to build a more comprehensive picture of how stars like Betelgeuse evolve and what factors influence their transformations.